Hey folks, welcome back. In this video, we're going to look at average velocity. So let's get started. Now, we'll briefly just look at average velocity and how it differs from normal velocity. So it says that velocity can also be written in terms of its average. Just as for speed, we use a line above the velocity symbol to represent average. So remember, velocity is defined as the displacement per unit time. So we can write down the equation for average velocity in a similar way. So we have average velocity v bar equals displacement s divided by the time, or in the form that you'll get on the relationship sheet in the exam, we have s equals v bar times t, where s is displacement measured in meters, v bar is average velocity measured in meters per second, and t is time measured in seconds. So this equation often comes in handy when you're doing questions involving calculating the resultant displacement of an object, and then you can use that displacement answer in this equation to find the average velocity, if you know the time as well. So just make sure you're reading the question that you're given to determine whether it's talking about velocity or average velocity. Same with when you're doing speeds and average speeds and instantaneous speeds. You need to know which one the question is talking about. That's all for this video, folks. I hope you found it useful. If you did, give it a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.